hell? Are you seeing this? Are you me? What year is it? Uh, 2023? 2023. So you're just starting out the podcast, huh? Yeah. Newsflash, it doesn't go well. You procrastinate like you always do, and you never achieve your dreams. You know what? Sit down. Maybe you can get some content out of this. Get you somewhere in life. <sighs> yeah, I gotta, I gotta set up real quick. This is a podcast, you know, you can ask me some questions. You know what? I do have a question. When did I become such an asshole? I just have no respect for you. You're half the man I am. What is this? How did you even get here in the first place? You couldn't comprehend it. Your mind is just too small. When was the last time you read a book? What, like four years ago? Did you really just go back in time to shit on me? Or yourself, I guess? No, but I do enjoy it. Can you believe this guy? Well, future me, when are you from? 2038. How the hell did you get here? Like I said, you wouldn't understand. Try me. Remember the island? No way. Yeah, you missed something that day. What did I miss? You want to give your audience some context? All 20 of them? Yeah, um, so my junior year of high school, I found a, a note in my locker. It was like a weird like binary ones and zeros code. And when I deciphered it, it was coordinates to a, a nearby island. I did some research, found out that it was government owned and there was some weird like shady stuff going on. This idiot decided it was smart to commit federal trespass. He brought two friends with as well. Yeah, uh, we got on the island. We didn't really find anything too out of the ordinary. And uh, we managed to get off without being seen. You were most certainly seen, buddy. So there is a secret organization known as Spectre uh, underneath the island. They specialize in time travel. And uh, that day they were trying to recruit young minds that they saw potential in. They saw potential in me back then? I was an idiot. You're still an idiot. Bro, shut up. Why are you even here? Don't you realize you're endangering the timeline just by talking to me? Wow, I should have given you more credit. Yeah, I am endangering the timeline. Why? Well, maybe if I make a big enough disruption, then my team will come find me. Your team? You, maybe I shouldn't say much more. Well, what can you tell me? That you're an idiot that still believes axolotls are only from Minecraft. Wait, they're real? Yeah, dumbass. I don't understand why you're being such an asshole. I don't think I've ever treated someone the way you're treating me right now. Listen, kid, I'll admit, you do have some potential. But no one in your life really challenges you to be better. You have your family that tell you all the time how proud they are of you. But you're not even proud of yourself. Why? I just, I know I can do so much better. Exactly, kid. You're the only one who can get yourself to where you want to be. No savior is going to come from the heavens and give you a blueprint on how to follow your dreams, man. That's all on you. You're still a dick. Don't worry, it's only to you. I know you can take it. You got a lot of people that love and care for you, man. Just make them proud. I will. Ah, oh, shit. I guess you're here to pick me up. Hey, please, for the love of God, do not go out with P... P who? Oh, my God, man. I got to avoid every girl whose name starts with a P. Hey, uh, I just wanted to come on here quick and uh, just say thank you guys for watching. Uh, I know I've been away for a while. I've just been, you know, figuring life out. But no matter how much I try to stay away from this YouTube stuff, it just keeps pulling me back. And I think this is something that I'm going to try to do for a while. So if you don't mind sticking around, smash that subscribe button, smash that like button. Let me know in the comments if you enjoyed this style of content. And if so, I'll try to bring out more of it. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.